Hey, how's it going, friends? My name is Angel Alex, and welcome back to the channel. We are back with some more of Mafia 3. Last episode was a lot. So much happened. Um, first off, one of the most amazing things ha that happened was we saw Vito. He's alive. He didn't die. He is old. He's an old man. But uh, he looking great. He looking great. I was really happy to see him. Uh, I'm curious to see like how he's gonna come into play later on in the story. And then after that, we finished the main job that we were doing in that bank with Georgie and uh, got the money. It was all great. Huge celebration. Woo, you know, debts paid off. Everything were good. But then shocker, surprise, Georgie shoots us. Sal takes all the money, kills, uh, what's his name? Sammy and uh, Ellis and somehow we survived the gunshot I mean we have this epic fucking scar on our head but um we survived and now uh we're on this path of vengeance looking to take over the whole damn city kill Sal Marcano and avenge our family so uh right now we are headed to oh wrong button to prostitution delray delray hollow the way of the, the way of flesh talk to the voice okay a very motivated local wants to help free the hollow of the dixie mafia that's right the dixie mafia is right now i think running the hollow or something so let's go ahead and head over there we don't have our cool car anymore i'm really hoping that like i bet you georgie has it that bitch he probably has it and I'm gonna, there's gonna be like a cool mission where we get our car back. That'd be great, right? I hope, because this car is all right, you know? Definitely not as cool as our other one. Uh, I'm gonna just park right here. All right, perfect parking, and let's head in. Lincoln, you a sight for so eyes. What's up? Whoa. Been a while. Wouldn't expect to see you working with the Haitians. It's either this or bow down to them fucking coon asses. And you know I ain't ever been one to bow down to anyone. <laughs> ain't that the goddamn truth? Cassandra phoned ahead. Say you going out to Perlis. Asshole named Merle Jackson runs it. Turned it into a brothel. That's white fellas come in and do whatever they want to our young sisters. How do I get to him? You don't. Not yet, anyway. A lot of those Dixie fucks try to stay out of sight. There's someone put a bullet up their ass. If I hit his operations, he'll have to come out and deal with me. I got an idea how to get his attention. He got some girls locked up on the second floor of Perlis. Calls them his thoroughbreds. Has them strung out on all kind of shit. He makes a lot of money off them. Go in there quiet. Get them out of there. I'll let you know when it's done. Hey, uh, I'm sorry to hear about Sammy and Ellis. They always did right by me. All right. Free the strung out girls. Talk to Sheila, all right? Out we go. Looks like it's just across. Busting up rackets. Every racket's vulnerable. Hurt their ability to, ability to make money to force the racket boss to come deal with the damage you've done. Draw out Merle by damaging his prostitution racket in the hollow. The first step in doing that is to free the girls being held hostage at... Deusits? Deusits? I kind of want to just jump across. And steal that yellow car over there. Let's do it. Graceful dive. Graceful dive. Alright. No police cars. Let's get in here. Cool, cool. Go ahead, bud. told me you'd be coming. The girls are upstairs. Be careful. Merle's people are all over the place. I will. Thanks. All right. We're gonna have to sneaky sneak around here. Free the girls. Um, what's this? Is this lock closed off? How do I get around? Let me give you some of this money. Let me look around. Maybe there's... Oh, hello. Take that.
Are they upstairs? How do I get upstairs? All right, let's follow this guy up here. Maybe it'll lead us somewhere. Damn, I killed him. Fuck. Oh, come on. Devil's making his presence known. Huh? Good so far. Some money here. Let's take this. All right, up here. Wait, what was that? we go I forgot you was born and raised here too mm-hmm fourth generation and I'm serious that place Mikey went right, to I'm waited out here best. they made et just like my mama I bet her gumbo was good too huh oh boy her gumbo her jambalaya red beans and rice my mama can't cook for shit never could <laughs> must be why you oh, ain't shit. much skin on them bones. this guy's coming up Fuck. Oh, no, he's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. Alright, oh, wait, there's money in here. I know. Oh, I hate that shit. Alright, that's fine. It's fine. Alright, let's hide. Need a second to reload. Does he know where I'm at? I don't think he does. I'll be over here. Go in here. Free these girls. Safe now. Spread the word. Any woman needing help should go to the pierced heart. Thank, thank you. Shit, is there somebody in here? Bitch. That's how you do it. You killed him. I did. You should kill all of them. Oh, I got you. Every last one. Get out of here. Now. Alright. We're good. Tell Charlie it's it's Le Leah. A, a good week. It's been it's been a good week. Wow. <laughs> Ronnie sold around five grand worth of shit and Jeannie. Jean brought in around seven grand. That'll get Richie out of our asses. All right. 
Got these girls. Let me open this up. That's you, fucker. Oh shit. Shit. <laughs> Bitch. Oh. All right. I want to make sure I get all the money. Can't go this way. Brother, brother, calm down. You have to use a lot of touch is all. Well, what am I supposed to do? Fucking animal. Huh? Take Sup, bitches. Damn. I don't use guns. I beat people with them. All right. <laughs> We're good. Uh, there's... Talk to Donovan? Okay. There we go. And there's one more money. What's the money for? I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure what the money's for, but I'm taking it. Alright, we're good. Okay, we're here at Donovan's. Alright, let's have a chat with him. I got a little something for you. You've been running around so much out there, I figured I'd make your life a little easier. You can use this to call on your support. And here I was thinking you were a heartless asshole. Jerry's still out on that one. Alright. Cool. All right, now we got a portable radio. Okay, but now we got to go back to the voice, talk to him, tell him we saved everybody. Calling associates. Cool, cool, cool. Hold L1 and then R to use. Gotcha. All right, here we are. Tell him that we saved all the girls. Thank you. You were sight for so I. I freed those women. God damn if that place in the hell hole. Pains you to see what those redneck fucks are doing, doesn't it? Soon as I get my hands on Jackson, that all comes to an end. Merle's got pimps scattered around the hollow. Is leaning on them to make up for what he's lost. Kill them, and he'll show up at the club. All right. When you're dealt with them, come back. I'll be able to confirm that Merle's over at the club. All right. Cool. Track down and kill Dixie patrols. Okay. Who's the boat? Objective panel. You now have multiple objectives available. Select objectives in the map are in the objective panel. Okay. Alright. I think let's just go ahead and light this place up, shall we? Only got... They don't have a lot of bullets. That's not a guy. What's up, bitches? Get out of my way. <laughs> Burn boy. Trying to pick up the money. Can't hide from me, boy. There we go. To the next one. All right, so now we're headed back to go talk to the voice again. You watching your back out there? Merle's holed up over at Perlis. What I hear, he's pissed as all hell. <laughs> Wish I could see that asshole's face right about now. Just so we're on the same page. Once I'm in there, I'm killing any motherfucker who gets in my way. Ain't no one shedding tears for those pricks. You do what you think's best. I'll be seeing you, Laveau. All right. Now we gotta kill him. We know where he is. He's across the pond. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think I might get some ammo, because I'm really low. Let me call that... 
Ammo, ammunitions, arms dealer. Could use some supplies. Heard you were the man to talk to. Cassandra said you might be coming. I'm happy to help, but I ain't running no charity either. Damn, dude. You're gonna run me over. See anything you Show need? me what you got. I'll be. Alrighty. Firearm equipment. Supplies. Supplies? No adrenaline shot. Link and upgrades. Just, is there not any uh, ammo? Ah, here we go. Refill ammo. I like this gun. I'll keep this. I'll fill, refill. I only get five bullets. Is that right? Alright, so I'm full on ammo, so... Uh, how much money do I have? 5,000. Should I buy the trench? The Tommy gun? Uh, maybe I'll just stick with the shotgun for now. And use my pistol. Um, what about Lincoln upgrades? What are those? Adrenaline shot, storage... Dock recovery. Okay, I haven't unlocked any this of that. Okay, we're good. All right, now let's head out. Still can't believe one of those jigaboo motherfuckers has the balls to come after us. Think they would have learned after Sammy. <laughs> a bunch of assholes. Don't see any of them around now. All right, let's sneaky sneak around. <laughs> These guys are some on- they're on some shit, man. Alright, let's head back up the way we did last time. Let's kill this motherfucker. Alright. We're good. Let's grab some more armor while we're at it. <laughs> Here, sneaky sneak. I'm good. I'm good. I gotta try those brutal takedowns. I need to try that. Okay, we're good here. Go across. There's a lot of guys over there. I'm gonna go this way. Oh man. Oh, they're all downstairs. Okay, good. Oh, no. One of them's right here. Huh? Come here, bitch. Stores is not working. Can we go around this way? Woo. Stay down. We're good. This guy's not gonna know what hit him. Purdy not only got the girls, he killed Doc, too. Yeah, he was deader than shit. Fuck. Doc gets off, boys out there running those whores get off. I think Merle's gonna have himself a coronary, he's so pissed. Just a nigger. How fucking tough can he be? He comes back, hmm? we'll... Oh, shit! Some bitches here! Move your ass! That was some ass. That was ass. I'm a... Bitch. Ah. Ah, motherfucker. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Alright, killing racket bosses. Neutralize the racket boss, take over a racket, then call on call an underboss to send over their people to help secure the racket. 
Kill Merle trigger Jackson to break up the prostitution racket. I ain't gonna save your ass. What the hell? Strolled on through here without a care in the world. Oh shit. All right, that works. Bro, what the fuck? His gun's empty. How do I do this? Go to cover. How do I do this? Let me see. I want to know. Okay, you hold it. Ah, oh, I see. Well, what you gonna do, nigger? This. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. That was my bad. Fuck that up, but we did it. First one down. All right, racket assignments. Two screaming Zimmy dolls will be added to your inventory. All right. <laughs> got some money. Is that, we got $30,000? For real? Assign to Cassandra, view associate upgrade path. Uh, let me just assign to Cassandra, why not? <laughs> uh, bug, bug. Dixie motherfuckers are out of Perlis. Have your men come lock it down. Good. I'll send some men over to see to the place. Run those Dixie motherfuckers out of the church and Richie will have to respond. All right, sweet. Getting shit done. Now, what's next? In uh, 1966, the FBI recruited me out of college. Uh, Chicago was my first assignment, but I was transferred down south in 68. I stayed there until 86, uh, when I was promoted to uh, assistant director of the criminal enterprise branch. I stayed with the bureau until my retirement in 1999. There are so many stories about Cassandra. Um, as a girl, she was kidnapped, killed, and brought back to life by a voodoo priest. Uh, she watched swamp rats rape and murder her sister. Uh, she shot her own father and dumped his body in the swamps. It, it's impossible to know what's true. Either way, she's been through some shit, right? Um, yeah, this is definitely a glitch. <laughs> Gotta wait for Donovan. <laughs> what is this, guys? I'm playing as him, but the camera is like mounted on <laughs> the. What the hell, bro? All right, can I get in the car and. What is up with the camera, bro? <laughs> what? what the hell? Hi, I'm Lincoln Clay, and welcome to my vlog. Bro, <laughs> okay, let me just restart the game. All right, here we go. Everything's good. Loaded in correctly. All right, now from here, we go talk with Donovan. All righty, here we are. Let's sit down, wait for our boy. Chapter 
First Baptist Church. Alright, wire trap. Wire tapping, not trapping. Uh, to wire tap rackets, break into junction box, which can be found around the city. Wire tapping rackets help Donovan mark targets at opportunity and collectibles on your map. Show an, an unknown enemies in the intel view and allows you to recruit racket bosses. Okay. Music, man, the music just kills the vibe. Like, it doesn't kill the vibe, but like, I'm probably gonna have to mute the damn thing. <laughs> okay, gotcha. You gotta explain to George All right, his interrogate God Charles. Sure. The fucking man. All right, I gotta interrogate this bitch. Oh, these motherfuckers. I might just want to beat the shit out of them. All right, informants interrogate informants to gather intel on racket on the racket and racket boss to get info. To get him to spill what he knows, isolate an informant from his crew to chase him to, to his car to drive like a madman. After interrogating an informant, you can either kill them or earn a little cash. Or recruit them and increase the earn of a racket once you take it over. See, most games I do tend to spare the guy. But with this case, I feel like... I, I don't know. Because I feel like recruiting them would be great. Increase our numbers, all that stuff. Um, but I really want to kill them too, just because of all the shit Lincoln's been through. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see when the moment comes. We run the hollow now. You tread on thin ice. Cause and effect, boys. If that's the effect, then what's the cause? So what's four finger got going on at the church? There's all Jeez. kinds of dope over at the church. If you destroy it, the boss is gonna lose a lot of money. Okay, get 500 now, add 1,000 to the racket. I'll, I'm gonna kill the first one. We're done here. Let's get... Bitches. All right, we're good here. Nothing to see. All right, destroy Charlie's heroin. All right, I kill the first one and then I'll start recruiting the rest probably. I just feel like Lincoln would want to kill them all just because he's pissed off, you know? All right, there's a shit ton of guys in here. I think I'm just gonna go ape shit on them. Um, okay, covert approach. Using a covert approach, you can quietly slip past enemies before going into combat. You mean stealth. I don't do still. If that canceled it or not. Take the money, take the money. Alright, targets. Targets are up of opportunity are the people and money making operations of for a racket. Destroy them to damage a racket. Targets are opportunities. Targets of opportunity are marked on the mini map. Okay. Each target of opportunity contains information on its difficulty amount of racket damage dealt and the amount of money to be found. Alright. 
Some more money. Get the rest of the money, get the ammo. Oh wait. Are you fucking kidding me? Here, here. Take the money. Take this. Let's get the hell out of here. Huh. Run, 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 run. Right, there's money right here. And armor, I'll take the armor. Armor, money, and the health. Where's the health at? Go. All right. There's money up here too. Wait. He's still here. Find him. All right, we're good. Let's get out of here. All right, gotta interrogate this guy. How do I want to do this? Going. Oh, I can't get in there. Excuse me, guys. Don't Looks mind like me. You're just um, doing some uh, work, you know. Hey oh, Alright, there we go. In we go. Sit down. Alright, there's one guy next to him. You lost, boy. Maybe. Leave, or I'll call the police. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm gone. Bye. I need to get out of the city soon. I think. He's sitting at the thing, okay. I almost look forward to the hollow show popping you up on the radio. Boy. Stick around, I'll let the police deal with you, good lord. Oh. Oh. Alright, witnesses, blah blah blah, I know. You're gonna tell me about the dope operation. The boss has got enforcers dealing around the hollow. Alright. Your ass is mine now. Take over here. If any of y'all got the time, oh, we got a call about a oh, homicide bitch. in the hollow. Dispatch out. Alright. We're out. We're out. We're out. We weren't here. Alright, we're good. We're good. Alright, we're, we're fine. We're fine. We're good. We're good. <laughs> All right, sentries are enemies who call in reinforcements. Gotcha. Oh, All right. Five, Don't work too hard, man. 15, 20, 25, 35, 50. Mm. Trying to see what we're dealing with here. get in here. Ah, right there. How do I use those throwables? Oh, I guess I don't have them with me. Is that right? Is it? 20, 25. All you just called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. 
Repeat, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrol. Ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty-five, fifty. Mm. Sub bitch. The town's coming from one of them goddamn voodoo towns. Creepy ass shit. Oh wait a second. I know you're nervous, but when Georgie shows up, just take a breath. And stay cool and don't ask questions. Charlie's a good man, but if you start pr pr praying, pratting, pr pratting, patting, that's weird. <laughs> uh, on prying, pr whatever, who, that looks like the pie sign. <laughs> on and make him look bad in front of Georgie, he'll end you for sure. Doing this hide and seek shit. All right, bye guys. Nice seeing y'all. <laughs> just snuck in and killed their guy, and then they didn't even know. All right, now let's head back. I've been listening in on old Charlie, and he isn't such a bad fellow. He's more of a kinder, gentler redneck, and as luck would have it. His wife is expected. Man in that situation usually doesn't care who he works for, as long as he's still above ground. <laughs> Poor sap starts blubbering when the two of them talk about names. Right now, it's between Bo Cephas and Thomas Lee. Anyway, his kind of name is the that? Church down, and all of them are more of the shoot first, let God sort them out variety of redneck. You get your hands on Charlie, though. He'll do what he's told without putting up much of a fuss. All your intel's been updated. You going back to the motel? After I get something to eat. I'll see you when you're done dealing with these inbred assholes. All right. Sounds good. All right. Rocket boss heavy hitter is an enforcer. Kill them to loosen the boss control. Recruiting bosses. Remember that you've previously wired ta tape the church and it's smack racket. Because you've done this, you'll know have the option to kill the racket boss for some quick cash or recruit them for improved earn in the long run. All right. What do we got here? Guys in there. Big boys right there. How do I get in here? Charlie and Merle, too. Fuck. <laughs> Come to that. My ass is vanishing. George will never find me out there in that park. Charlie called in all the boys. We're good. We just need to hunk it down and wait for that nigga. Y'all said a name yet? We well, think about Thomas Lee, my old man. Mm, that's got a new drink, dude. This shit with us getting hit doesn't get settled. My boy might wind up being named something else. No, it won't come to that. The boys will take care of it. You'll see. Work for me, and you might live long enough to raise your family. Okay, sure thing. Whatever you want. That's good, Charlie. Real good. Ow! 
Oh, he still fucking broke his arm. All right, we got it. <laughs> Damn. That wasn't too bad. Uh, what about the upgrade path? Gunsmith improved accuracy. 60,000. Oh, I see. Okay, now let's assign to Cassandra. Send your men to the First Baptist Church. Those Dixie heathens have been handled. I'll have some of my men come right over. And thanks. All right. Please state your name for the record. Donovan. John. Mr. Donovan, you understand that by appearing before this committee, you have explicitly waived your constitutional rights in regards to counsel and self-incrimination. Sure. And you further acknowledge that by appearing before this committee, you agree to disclose all information pertaining to the events that occurred in New Bordeaux during the summer and fall of 1968. <laughs> I wouldn't be sitting here if I didn't. You were an operative in the Central Intelligence Agency from 1953 to 1969, is that correct? That's right. When did you arrive in Vietnam? August of 1961. Please describe for this committee the actions you took during your time in Vietnam. I spent a couple months in Saigon, and then I was transferred to a base in Laos that was operated by the Special Activities Division. We trained and equipped the Hmong and then turned them loose on the NVA. We're running arms and supplies via the Ho Chi Minh Trail. And you worked with Lincoln Clay in what eventually became the Phoenix Program. Within a year or so, Lincoln was heading up his own PRU. We'd cross over into Vietnam and locate enemy targets and either kill them or bring them back for interrogation. <laughs> Just thinking about it? Jesus Christ. You wouldn't believe the shit we did to those cocksuckers. Oh no, here we go with the freaking camera again. What the hell's going on? Well, all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode there. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't yet. And make sure you leave a comment showing your support for the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.